determine the torque that can be applied to a solid shaft of 20 mm so d is equal to 20 mm d is equal to 20 mm diameter without exceeding an allowable shearing stress of 65 u newton per mm square so shear stress is equal to 65 newton per mm square what torque can be applied if shaft is replaced by a hollow shaft so here case 1 and case 2 same sectional area with inner diameter equal to half of its outer diameter hollow shaft inner diameter is equal to 0.5 u times of its outer diameter to find torque of solid shaft t we have a formula t by j is equal to tau by r this is tor original formula so rearranging this t is equal to tau by r multiply by j so j polar moment of inertia is equal to pi by 32 d raised to 4 is equal to pi by 32 value of d is 20 raised to 4 is equal to 15.70 into 10 raised to 3 t is equal to 65 u divided by r is r is equal to d divided by 2 is 20 divided by is equal to 10 mm so r is 10 multiply by j is 15.70 into 10 raised to 3 1002.05 0, 0, 0. into 10 raised to 3 newton per mm so t is equal to 102.05 newton per meter with the same sectional area a area of solid shaft is equal to area of hollow shaft so area of solid shaft is pi by 4 multiply by d square is equal to area of hollow shaft is pi by 4 multiply by capital d square minus small d square so pi by 4 pi by 4 get cancel value of d square is 20 square is equal to d square minus d square d square is equal to d square minus inner di we have equation for inner diameter is d is equal to 0 0.5 u multiply by capital d so minus 0 0.5 u multiply by capital d and bracket square so 20 square is equal to first we solve the bracket minus 0 0.5 u multiply by 0 0.5 u 0 0.5 u square is 2 phi u so 0 0.2 phi u and d square imagine this d square have value of 1 so 1 minus 0 0.2 phi u d square is 0 0.7 phi u d square d square is equal to square of 20 is 400 so 400 divided by 0 0.7 phi u and we get phi u 33.33 and d is equal to taking square root of phi u 33.33 we get value of d is equal to 23.09 and put this value in diameter equation d is equal to 0 0.5 u multiply by d so 0 0.5 u multiply by value of capital d is 23.09 so we get 11.5 u for 7 next get find the polar moment of next find the polar moment of inertia of hollow hollow shaft next find the polar moment of inertia of hollow shaft pi by 32 multiply by d raised to 4 minus d raised to 4 so j is equal to pi by 32 value of capital D is 23.09 raised to 4 minus value of small d is 11.547 raised to 4 
सो जे इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट वन सेवन इंटू टेन रेस टू थ्री एंड नेक्स्ट फाइंड द टॉर्क ऑफ होलो होलो शाफ्ट सो टी बाय जे इज इक्वल टू टाउ बाय आर सो रिअरेंजिंग दिस सो टी इज इक्वल टू टाउ बाय आर मल्टीप्लाय बाय जे सो टाउ ऑफ होलो शाफ्ट सो टॉर्क ऑफ होलो शाफ्ट इज इक्वल टू वैल्यू ऑफ शेयर स्ट्रेस इज सिक्सटी फाइव डिवाइड बाय आर इज डी डिवाइड बाय टू इज आर ऑफ होलो शाफ्ट इज इक्वल टू डी डिवाइड बाय टू टू वैल्यू ऑफ डी इज ट्वेंटी थ्री पॉइंट जीरो नाइन डिवाइड बाय टू एंड वी गेट इलेवन पॉइंट फाइव फोर फाइव फुट दी सर इलेवन पॉइंट फाइव फोर फाइव मल्टीप्लाय बाय पोलर मोमेंट ऑफ इनर्शिया ट्वेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट वन सेवन इंटू टेन रेस टू थ्री सो टी हॉलो इज इक्वल टू वन फोर सेवन पॉइंट थ्री फोर इंटू टेन रेस टू थ्री न्यूटन पर एम एम एंड टी हॉलो इज इक्वल टू वन फोर सेवन पॉइंट थ्री फोर न्यूटन पर मीटर